диск. Повторяю питание. Зажигание кислород. Т-минус 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Турбо пумпс от флайт спид. And liftoff. Liftoff of the 48th Progress resupply ship on a six-hour sprint to the International Space Station. The Soyuz booster lighting up the Central Asian desert. Pitch program is in. First and second stage thrusters operating normally according to reports from the Russian Mission Control Center in Korolyov. The vehicle is stable. Good pitch program. At the time of uh, liftoff, the International Space Station was 2,360 miles ahead of the progress. Pitch roll in your program all nominal. Seventy seconds into the flight, uh, the first stage will uh, continue uh, operating for about a minute, 58 seconds. The first stage then will shut down and separate along with four strap-on boosters at an altitude of 30 miles while the vehicle is downrange at about 73 miles from the Baikonur Cosmodrome. And third stage shutdown now confirmed by flight controllers of the Russian Mission Control Center. Standing by for spacecraft separation. The vehicle now is separated, Progress 48 in its preliminary orbit, as we stand by for confirmation of navigational antenna and solar array deploy. And now confirmation that all antennas and solar arrays have been deployed. Progress 48 has, has begun its uh, expedited flight to the International Space Station following a flawless launch and climb to orbit. This is Mission Control Houston. Uh, you're looking at a view of the Progress uh, 48, fresh off the launch pad of the Baikonur Cosmodrome in Kazakhstan, having uh, accelerated uh, through uh, a compact series of rendezvous maneuvers uh, and now in the fly around of the International Space Station, the fly around uh, has begun at a distance of just uh, 290 meters away from the pier's docking compartment. Uh, this fly around uh, will once again enable the, the progress uh, through its automated computer program uh, to precisely align its forward docking probe with the pier's uh, docking port, enabling uh, a period of just a, a few minutes of uh, station keeping in which uh, the approach will be zeroed out uh, enabling Russian flight controllers to assess its alignment uh, to the pier's docking compartment before the command is given for the final uh, approach for docking. Uh, 260 meters, uh, zero decimal 44 is the rate. This station is um, very visible, very clear. You can see, we can see the DC, all modules, K copy. 70 meters, zero three. 52 is the rate target is in the center and the crosshairs are matching uh, so uh, the everything is stable copy just 70 meters now separating uh, the two vehicles closing at a rate of 0.3 meters per second everything uh, functioning perfectly on the progress 48 just about 30 meters separating uh, the two craft Progress uh, will disappear uh, behind uh, the Kibo module that you're seeing in the foreground of your picture. And uh, we will, we are getting ready to send the command BPS and also uh, the operation command. We have 30 meters. Okay, so I am sending BPS initial, then operation, and also breakaway enabled. Copy. 
Can we use the AGC mode? Yes, you can. Thirty meters now separating the two spacecraft. Uh, progress uh, closing at a perfect rate of one tenth of a meter per second. Once again, uh, this uh, unpiloted vehicle will stay docked to the pier's docking compartment until Christmas Day, when it will uh, undock and make room uh, for yet another craft. The next Progress vehicle, Progress 49, is scheduled uh, to be launched from the Baikonur Cosmodrome on November 1st and docked to the aft port of the Zvezda service module, currently occupied by the Eduardo Amaldi automated transfer vehicle for the European Space Agency. So the target is shifted a little bit to the right, but everything is within the limits. The vehicle is moving very um, steadily. Copy. So Baza Air, we have now, uh, now it is on AO. Great views of the Progress 48, which just a few hours ago sat atop the third stage of a Soyuz booster on Gagarin's launch pad at the Baikonur Cosmodrome in Kazakhstan, now about to complete an accelerated rendezvous and docking to the International Space Station. 17 meters, 0.12. Just 17 meters separating the two craft. Progress 48 and the International Space Station traveling from southwest to northeast across the Pacific Ocean, west of South America. Moving towards the center. Copy. Fifteen meters zero thirteen is reached. Copy. The target is in the center. Copy. So you are defining the uh, range visually, yes. Um, visually and also using the uh, ruler. We have a special ruler, it's very convenient. Yes, I understand. Uh, 10 meters now is the range and 0.14 uh, is the rate. Copy. And progress now less than 10 meters away, standing by for contact and capture. 10 meters uh, is already done. Copy. We're at 8 meters now, not more than uh, 0 0.1 is the rate. 7 meters. Uh, the vehicle is stable, 6 meters is the range. Copy. The docking target now aligned with the forward docking probe on progress thanks to the core's automated rendezvous system just four meters away. The rate, the rate is about one, uh, 0.1. Copy. Three meters. Three meters. Copy. One meter is the range. We are expecting the contact. Copy. Contact. contact. Docking confirmed. Copy. At 8.18 p.m. Central Time. Fine. Beautiful. Docking confirmed. Progress 48 completes a six-hour ride in the express lane from Baikonur to the International Space Station. According to the procedure, okay. Copy. We'll 